This video is meant for the educational purpose. Please ensure you understand the step before using any script. The goal is to help you to learn how to complete the lab effectively while following the Quick Lab Turns and Services and YouTube Community Guidelines. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. In this video, I am going to guide you through the process to complete this lab and help you to understand each step. First. Login with your quick lab credentials and once done with that, in the description box of this video, I have shared the GitHub link which will help you to automate some tasks over here. However, I will recommend you to follow along and understand what each command does so you can learn the process effectively. I will encourage to open and review the script to understand each step. So first of all, just let me scroll down over here and from here just let me open this link in incognito window over here. This will activate your cloud shell. So just let me wait for that. and is finally done now just me come back over here and from here you can see this call command this command will download this github repo from my github repo to your cloud shell so just me copy this come back and paste over here like this way now we have to make this file executable for that we have to just me copy this command come back over here paste hit enter now we have to just me run this file for that just me copy this command come back over here paste hit enter wait for a second now here you can see for processor name just me come back to the lab instructions and click on the task number two from here you can see this name so just me copy this one come back paste hit enter now for the region just me copy this region come back paste hit enter wait for a second and then just me click on this authorize button over here now this command will take a couple of minutes so make sure that your laptop will not go for a sleep otherwise your cloud shell will be disconnect and because of that you might face an error once all this command get execute you have to just me check the score for the lab so now just me wait for a couple of minutes
and is finally done. Now if you just may come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for each and every task, you will get a score without any issue. And if the score is not updated for any particular task, no need to worry. Wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score on this lab without any issue. Just may wait and watch. And as you can see, it's done. As I said, lab take time to update the score, so don't worry about that. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day, guys. Remember, this video is for educational purpose. Please make sure you understand the step and follow the quick lab terms and services and YouTube community guidelines.